on guys it's surfcast in the island and today i'm going to show you how to make the modified oil break knot i'm sure you guys have heard of this in other tutorial videos of how to tie the actual modified um, oil break but mine is a little bit of a variation um, i double the line over um, my braid onto my mono or floor depending on what i'm using because in the past i found that uh, if you use a single strand braid as your leader um, to mainline connection it has a tendency to slip and that's the last thing you want when uh, if you're using it to tie directly to a rig or using it as backing. Typically I use this knot more so for backing um, as opposed to rigs like I mentioned previously. So to start here's the uh, 20 pound test Tyviz Power Pro. Um, that's what I'm going to be using as the main line and here we have 50 pound test Andy which I've been using in all my videos pretty much with the exception of maybe one or two. So we're going to start with doubling over both the leader line like this as you would start the regular oil bright. Now you're going to take your main line which would be the power pro and double that over as well. Now, the doubled over Power Pro side, you're going to enter through the loop of the leader, 50 pound Andy. I'd say about six inches. You can see there it goes through. And now, since it's doubled, if you do eight to 10 turns, that's going to be more of, you know, eight, 18 to 20 turns, um, just because the, um, the doubled main line is making it, uh, you know, twice the strands. So you're going to do 8 to 10, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There you go. You can see you have all your weaves right there, so that's about 20 turns if you um, did it single strand. You're going to enter that tag end of the main line back through the loop that you made like that. You want to pinch it a little just to get those weaves intertwined. Now all you're going to do is wet the braid in the main line like so. Pull all tag ends between the main line and the leader like this until it really cinches down. You may want to use your fingernail for both ends. And you'll end up with something like this. Again, it's not the prettiest knot but I've never had it slip. What we're gonna do now is trim, trim the tag ends. You can have four tag ends with this knot. I know it's a lot, but do the mono first. We'll do the double strand braid. And we'll do the braid up going through the top single strand. Again, it's not the prettiest knot, but it's not going to go anywhere. And this is what how I do and how I tie my modified oil braid. You could trim those tag ends a little more, but I just wanted to show you where they were coming from. And uh, again, this is something I'd use more so for backing as opposed to tying direct. I'm not a big fan of tying direct when it comes to uh, surf casting off the beach. If I was boat fishing, that'd be a different story, but that's not the perp main purpose of this channel. But um, yeah, that pretty much concludes this video. If you guys have any questions or comments, please like, comment, and hit that subscribe button. Thank you.